So excited to use this. I am on the road right now. And I popped out the new vlog camera. It is looking spectacular. I'm so stoked to just use this as my vlog camera. I can't wait to post my new video with this, but I am on my way to run a few errands. This weekend we have two birthday parties that we have to attend on Saturday and then a bridal shower. So I have to get a couple of things. I don't have the kids with me today. Um, so it's just mom going solo, but she is on a time crunch because she woke up late. And um, so I gotta get things done and I'm heading out to Monterey. I do need some coffee first, so I'm hoping either go to Alta Bakery. Ah, I'm getting a phone call. Hold on. Um, I'm going to either go to Alta Bakery and grab something quick or if not, Captain Stokers, we'll see. Um, but I, yeah, I'm on my way to run for a few errands and I just kind of wanted to catch you guys up on my life right now. So as a mom, I am feeling great. My journey of my diet has been going wonderful. There are those days where, for example, Michael brought his crumble cookie um, box of uh, home yesterday and I kind of splurged on it, but I also tracked my macros. So it's pretty nice about cookie crumbles that you can get the nutrition facts on their app. So that's what I did and just was uh, again kind of mindful of it but I did have a whole cookie of course I was going to um, and so health wise um, you know emotionally mentally I've been doing great I really enjoy just kind of vlogging um, spending my time with my boys I don't know if some of you kind of wonder like oh my gosh why is she off and why are they doing so much stuff it's because I'm using my FMLA time right now after I had Riker so I will be going back and returning to work at the end of October we'll see how that goes but that's kind of at where I'm at with mom as far as balancing time with my children I feel like it's been a blessing to see Rowan really adapt to having a relationship with Riker um you know he's I don't know I just have really positive things to say about it he's so sweet you know when when Riker's crying he tries to soothe him by patting on his chest or giving him a kiss so I I know that that might have been like a challenge for uh Rowan in the beginning when we first brought home Riker and it was definitely tough for both of us I mean non-stop you know on the go trying to manage sleep here and there and then Michael still has his business which I've been you know we've been in prayer about and how much it's grown and whatnot and so um yeah I, I feel like we've adjusted pretty well now I, I will say it had been challenging in the beginning and um, I'm glad we kind of got over that three month hump we're still working through it you know Riker does wake up twice out of the night still wants to feed um, one thing I this is new that I haven't shared with a lot of people is that I am doing a balance now of breastfeeding and formula um, that is just a choice that's recently um, came about. I think it puts less stress on me, allows me to feel like I can get out and go do something without feeling rushed as well. So that is it regarding the boys. Michael and I are doing great as well. I mean, just trying to spend as much time as we can as, um, as a couple we have a really fun trip coming up in October and actually sorry we have a fun trip coming up next week we are heading to Disneyland with the boys just us four well we did invite our the grandparents but um, just us four and then in October we are heading to Mexico so I'm really excited about that as well but that is just kind of an update as to where we've been at and um, I'm gonna take you along with me to run my errands like I said coffee I have to stop at the mall and I think that's it but I will keep you guys updated I gotta do a, a, a little bit of shopping just a little bit got some coffee from Alta Bakery. I'm walking back. Um, I got a few items, some cargo pants, like a little cute vest crop top and something for Riker to wear, like I mentioned. And then I purchased a few items from Sephora. I probably look stupid right now with the camera walking. And anyways, I got Alta Bakery, um, a chia pudding, some coffee and a ham sandwich. I am in the car, this is the 
ham sandwich that I purchased from Alta Bakery, and I also got a chia pudding um, to go cup. I love chia pudding, I make this at home. But since my day has been a slow start, I had to purchase something to go. I'm a little out of breath because I gotta get home for the boys. So I had went to Sephora on Thursday, it is Sunday night, and I wanted to share some of the products that I purchased. So I ended up for my first one, I got this Beauty Blender Blender Cleanser. So typically I will use hand soap to clean my Beauty Blender, but I feel like it doesn't take out all the, of the um, makeup on the makeup blender. You hear Riker in the back. Um, so I ended up purchasing this and it's a lavender scent. I would have preferred no scent at all, but I definitely want to recommend this uh, product right here. I think it is a great cleanser to have for your beauty blender. I also, like I mentioned before, ended up purchasing the Luminous Silk. Uh, can I get that? Yes, that's right. And uh, the Giorgio Armani. Um, I feel like, this is just my opinion on, on my skin, uh, when I wear the NARS, it just kind of rubs off on my baby's clothes and I feel like this one just gives you a flawless look. I mean, I, it's pretty expensive, but I think if you're gonna invest in a foundation, it's a good product to have. One of the last things I got, um, I haven't really purchased a perfume in a while, so I went in and I ended up getting this Burberry perfume it's called her it gives it's more of like a fresh scent it kind of reminds me i don't know if you guys remember the dk and y apple scent but this is kind of what it smells like but it's bomb you guys should try it and lastly i didn't end up purchasing it but i wanted to buy the bigger bottle it's by um dry bar i need a heat protectant so i wanted to try this i actually got this as a um using my points so i had about like 200 points and i asked how did i get how can i get this little mini one just to try it as a sample um i was able to use a hundred of my points so we are in the month of october and if you want to give this a try and if you have any other recommendations i would love to hear about what you guys use as a heat protectant but i really like this hottie toddy one and it's been working really well for my hair so i just wanted to kind of catch you up so thursday was pretty busy Friday, let's see, Michael. Friday was working Friday and Saturday. I ended up heading to Hollister. We went to the Hollister game, which was really awesome. We got to see my nephew doing his marching band. Saturday, um, lots of errands. I had to come back and drop the dogs off. Went to Sadie's birthday. After Sadie's birthday, we went to Cameron's birthday. Had to get the boys ready for bed, so I didn't do a lot of vlogging. And then today, Sunday, was Liz's bridal shower, which you will see on my channel. And that's kind of been my weekend. It's been pretty busy, so but I'm really excited because we have something that we're filming tomorrow, and I can't wait for you guys to check it out. Anyways, thanks for catching up with me. This is what's been going on. Busy life, but I love it. Can't complain. Blessed. Have a wonderful night. All right, so we just got here. We are celebrating Liz. She's getting married in October. We are heading to Mexico, but today we celebrate her bridal shower. So come on in with me. All right, here's our beautiful bride. <laughs>
did a challenge with a toilet paper. You can make the best dress, so we're gonna go ahead and check them out.